All right, ladies and gentlemen, Ben here. So this is the entirety of the war stories, at least so far. I would imagine EA's got DLC planned in the future, which may include some new campaigns. But as you can see, we've got war stories. Now, we've already completed Storm of Steel, which is basically, you know, the prologue. And then we've completed Through Mud and Blood, where we were a British Mark V tank, which was pretty awesome. We followed around Black Bess, destroyed a shit ton of tanks, had some pretty good, you know, concealed sniper, sneak around towns, ambushing, shoveling people, all that good stuff, silenced weapons galore, and hollow sights, because, you know, World War One. But we've also got Friends in High Places, Battle for Air Supremacy is a volunteer pilot in the British Royal Flying Corps. We've also got Avanti Savoia, volunteer for the Italian Arditi, a shock trooper unit battling amongst the Italian Alps. That sounds pretty sweet. We've got Nothing is Written, join Lawrence of Arabia in his desert campaign against the Ottoman Empire. And then we also have The Runner. Now this is pretty sweet. Storm the beaches of Gallipoli under the guns of the largest naval fleet hitherto assembled. Have you guys ever heard about the Gallipoli campaign? It was amazing. Winston Churchill. From all over the world. The innocent, Let's just listen. The arrogant and the brave. We thought the war was to be our rite of passage. A grand adventure that would make us all equal in our quest for glory. But instead of adventure, we found fear. And in war, the only true equalizer is death. All right, so it looks like we've got three missions to complete. We've got Cape Helles, lead the charge onto the beach. We got Be Safe and the Runner. Now, honestly, this jumped out to me because this was World War One D-Day. Now, this is the Dardanelles. It's uh, the strait where you go from basically the Mediterranean to the Black Sea, I believe. Very strategic. And the Turks just, the Ottomans rather, the Ottoman Empire had this thing just so fortified. Let's see what we, let's see what we jump into. The Dardanelles, Gallipoli Peninsula, Spring 1915. The British Empire intends to open a new front to the war. Plans for an unprecedented naval invasion of the Ottoman homeland are drawn up. The attacking naval forces represent the biggest single fleet yet assembled. The gathered ships carry over half a million men. Australia, New Zealand, Ireland, India, Newfoundland, France, Britain. Their orders are to land and march on the capital of Constantinople. Everybody under the British Empire, ladies and gentlemen. Well, almost everybody. Day one, at Cape Helles, the steamship River Clyde is used as a Trojan horse. Crashing onto the beach, it deploys several battalions of allied soldiers. A tenuous beachhead is seized. Half the landing force is killed. Day two. Oh my god. World War One D-Day. Holy shit. Holy shit. Frederick Bishop? Oh, God. Hey, are you Frederick Bishop? Nope. He's dead, sorry. <laughs> but uh, isn't this your picture? I suppose so. Jack Foster. I I'm your new charge. No, you're not. You have to take this kid off me. <laughs> of course not. He came all this way just to see you. Frederick Bishop, the pride of Australia. I'm gonna lie about his age to get past conscription. You know Morse code? Yes. Follow me! Hell yeah. Well, what a disaster. Our first wave didn't stand a chance. Look at all their defenses. How can we take the beach? We have the dreadnoughts this time. Plug your ears, kid. It's gonna be loud. Dreadnoughts. 
Direct the Dreadnought Barrage. World War One D-Day! Send these coordinates. Aye aye, Captain. Captain Fisher. Or Bishop. Oops. <laughs> Hell yeah! D-Day, baby! Oh shit, firing back. Airburst runs. That's it. Time to go. Ooh, where do you think you're going? With you. Let where you go. Yeah, okay, you're staying here. And you'll move up with rear command only after I fire the signal flare. Yes, sir? Yes, sir. I'm trying to stay out of trouble. Dude, this guy looks like a badass, man. What you doing the there, mate? Oh, they're, they're wounded. Whoops. Holy shit, boys. Just look at that. Just look at this. D-Day, baby! It's like Call of Duty, the good one all over again. Oh my god. Where's all this machine gun fire coming from? Holy shit! Oh my god. Oh my god, that's terrible. Here the trenches. I don't see anybody yet. Oh shit! Holy shit! Oh, we got a shot A. This. Ooh, a rifle grenade? Nah, I like what I got. Yeah, this is pretty intense. Yo, what are you what you doing, big guy? Let's let's go. Nice grenade. Oh, those guys should not have charged that. How World War One? <laughs> he dodged my bullet. Oh, I thought that was a Turk, an Ottoman. Gotta capture that overlook. Da, 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 da. Oh, I killed somebody. I didn't even see shit. But hey, man, when you got a belt fed machine gun, you're gonna take it. You are gonna use it, boys. Bennett! Oh my god. That did not work at all. Through the gun slits. Isn't this the overlook? Can we turn this? Let's try. So if we can use it, that'd be pretty sweet. Oh, a little high. Reloading. You may fall when ready. Direct hit. I mean, we got a like an armored plate right here in front, so cute little machine guns be damned. What? <laughs> Fired between the machine gun and the guy. This is, uh, we're finding our range, as it were. 
What's up, buddy? Alright. Oh, man. My awesome shotgun. Or my awesome rifle. Give it. Eh, we still got a few rounds left. I don't need to switch it yet. We've got to push towards that overlook. Push towards that overlook, damn mate. My name's Russell Crowe. And I'm just, uh, storming the beaches. Yo, this motherfucker killed my guy. Damn, just killing each other. Let's go, boys. Holy shit! What happened to all my reinforcements? All my guys are down. There should be one left. And he's right here. <laughs> oh, that's kind of brutal, actually. to be sprinting to use bayonet. That was special. Eight bullets left. It's about time to get that new rifle. This doesn't have to send up the flame. Boys, let's see what happens now. You fucking kidding me? Come with me. Get. Look, look at that, huh? Kid, you lied your way to hell on earth. I just, you just wanted a statue of yourself in your town square. I think I'm gonna be sick. <laughs> Come on, kid, get up. Come on. Come on. I'm gonna die. No, you're not. You're Australian. Huh. We're impossible to kill. Yeah. I guess so. Unless. Not a Kiwi, are you? <laughs> no. Now, first things first. Yeah, come on, stand up. Follow me. I'm in here. Just arm out. Butt into your shoulder. That's it. Cheek against the butt. All oh, right, that's it. Point where you want to shoot. That's it. Okay. Get your feet apart a little bit. beginning to think I already lost my Australians. What can I do you for? Not you, the boy. We need a runner for the front lines. Really? No. Yes. No. You can't make the kid do it. You just stumble into a firefight and get killed. No, 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 I can do it. No. I'll do it. Fine. You're here with me, and you, you will be running. So I kid you not, um, I got a knock on the door and it was a graphics card that I ordered like two days ago off Amazon. So after this video, I'm installing a graphics card, new graphics card, GTX 1080, baby, woohoo! Alright, so I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. What do I gotta do? Man, 
This is what happens when you miss the. Can I can I take over your gun? This is this isn't like uh, Halo. Still got my shotgun, nine shells. Oh, oh, give me the dynamite! Hell yeah. Trip bar bomb? Yes. Ooh, give her a 98 sniper. Don't mind if I do. Oh, we got some boys here. That went red. kind of make themselves hard to hit when they do that. I didn't even see any- holy shit! Those guys blend in really, really well. I should get that ammo, shouldn't I? I mean, they're all the same shells. Let's see if there's anything over here. Any ammunition for the sniper would be fantastic. Someone with a big piece of artillery up there. I've got four shells left with the sniper. Mother of balls. Oh. Well, that ain't gonna work. I'm gonna sneak behind that artillery piece if possible. Light it the fuck up. Don't you turn that shit at me. Where's that a machine gun? That's a machine gun. Indeed. We gotta have a window up here I can use. Come on. Yes, throw a lure. Thank you. Surely up on this. Alright. But is there any way? It's just a rifleman. No machine gun? That was in his butt. Only a few more bullets left, so we'll go to the shotgun where we only have five shells. We're gonna have to pick up a new weapon relatively soon. I thought I saw another artillery piece. Yeah, looks like trouble, alright. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Come get it. This is the problem. You know what? We're going to take him out. We've got how many shells and how many bullets? Come get me. What? Real bad shot. I 
I want more bullets. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. Fuck it. We're hitting the objective now. This trip wire did not work. I guess he what? Walked to the rest? We'll pick it back up though. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. What's up, boys? Holy shit, everybody's wounded. Don't mind me. I will uh, happily pick that up. Let's see what else we got here. Ooh, I'm SMG. Over my, yeah. I believe in you, boys. Hold fast. Just looting everything. Rifle grenade? Nah. What's happening to us? Here's a good news. Butts pounded. This whole thing is going to shit. I need to get back to water. Fuck. Boys, going back through the village where I just came. So I guess I was a piece of communication. In our first playthrough in Mud and Blood, we found out, you know, we were a pigeon at one point. Now at least this time, I'm a link in communication that can fire back. Oh shit. We've got some Ottomans moving over here. Their white uniforms really blend in well with these... Was it? Is it terracotta? I don't know what it's called. But these white buildings. Oh shit, they're just charging a Brits? Yeah. Defend the command outpost. Well, I gotta get there first. Like not on full auto right now. It's like on a three round burst mode. Oh, I heard you, you little bastard. Where'd you go? I think they're all dead. We already raided these crates. Heading forward. Oh, get up off this shit. Oh my god. Who's that? Kind of like that. Well, it's got eight bullets. All personnel correct, sir. Attack. Get them lads. Look at that. But I didn't. <laughs> sure fucking didn't. <laughs> nice shot. Oh, well, you know, I just kind of saw him out there and I... <laughs> <laughs> you got falling lines across the board. <sighs> That's what I thought. Bishop, go tell rear command that we'll be moving up. Hey, don't worry. I can handle myself here. Head down. Got up. No open areas. Got it. Got it. Runner, runner. Got to get to rear command. I don't imagine what we're heading back to the ships then. <laughs> Reloading mag. The only thing that sucks about these guns is the mag sticks up and blocks what feels like an, an exorbitant amount of your field of view. What's in this? Ooh, field manuals. There's kind of like, almost like Mario's red coins from Mario 64 where you gotta like get them in each level to like complete it kind of a thing. There is a machine gun right there. No, that's a horse. Hell yeah. Where is everyone? In 
investigate rear gate command. Well, I'm gonna leave the horse there for now. Did they get raided by the Ottomans? Oh, <laughs> retreat order. Holy shit. Hey guys, retreat. For those who didn't hear from a runner, the Allied position is lost. Artillery fire ordered to cover retreat to beach, shelling the village and outlying forts. Shit. Foster. Yep, horsey time. They're gonna artillery right where all those guys are. Fucking Brits. Shelling their own position to cover a retreat. <laughs> uh. Yeah! Shit. Artillery already. Fuck. Sorry, buddy. Got more important things than killing all of you. Wait, Why this not? is news from the rear. Oh. Save it, Bishop. Help us here first. Prepare yourselves, men. I was expecting a bigger rush. Behind these lines here. Sans this machine gun. Where do you think you're going? <laughs> Hatch it to the. Oh damn it! Oh shit! Had to shoot this guy in the legs. This is probably a bad spot. Now what? Get back to the ship? Full scale retreat. They're gonna shell the village in the fort to cover us. We need to get out. Now. I, I sent men up to secure the fort. A dead man? Who went? That boy. Only those who volunteered, so naturally all of them. Fucking kids. Well, you remember being his age? Foster. He's in my charge. I gotta get that kid. Go. I'll pretend I didn't see you. This isn't on you. Of course it is. One more death for me to live with. Go, go, you don't have much time. All right, to the fort. Storming a fort by myself. And I called Foster an 